You know, she's like a defiant toddler playing with a priceless vase. Can you just stop, Nicola? There's a whole load of mess already going on without you constantly trying to get attention. And so Sturgeon is ploughing ahead with her rabid referendum plan, forgetting, it seems, she lost one not even a decade ago. Well, frankly, it doesn't seem the polling has changed a jot. If anything, it's less in her favour. But she's determined to waste tens of millions on a vote in October, right when people won't be able to pay for their heating and will be turning into icicles in Inverness, as Putin also tests the will of the new UK Prime Minister as to what happens to the nuclear deterrent. Does she really think, in the middle of this global mayhem, Scotland with an economy essentially resembling Zimbabwe in the 90s, is somehow going to be better by severing the financial umbilical cord with Blighty. Her big problem would be if we actually called her bluff and she won the vote. I doubt you'd ever see someone scuttle from office to the garden shed to start writing autobiographies so fast.